Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to The Gamer Couple. My name's Sam, and as always, I'll be joined by 80 for today's video. Today, we're going to be showing you guys four advanced building techniques to up your game in Fortnite. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right on into it. Now, real quick, we wanted to give a huge thank you to ProGuides for partnering up with us on this video. As you guys know, we don't take many sponsorships on the channel unless we really believe in what the company does. ProGuides is an amazing website that solely focuses on helping people improve in Fortnite. They have tons of new pro tips and courses to help you guys with anything that you're struggling with. They also have multiple pro players on staff that can answer any questions you guys have after a video. ProGuides is an amazing way to improve quickly and we highly recommend checking them out. A link to their website will be in the description below. Coming in at number 4, we have a brand new way to do a 90 degree turn after flooring and pyramiding yourself. Whenever you floor and pyramid yourself, you usually edit through both of them and then continue building up. This technique is perfectly fine, but there is a faster way to take high ground by utilizing the pyramid. When editing through the pyramid, you want to reset it and then select the other corner square. This will make your pyramid into the same shape as a ramp and allow for a 90 degree turn. This technique is super difficult to learn, but can be extremely beneficial in game. This took us about an hour to master, but it feels amazing once you can do it consistently. We actually learned this tip from our friend Martaz, and he learned it from his friend Slazzy. We highly recommend checking both of them out, so links to their socials will be in the description below. Coming in at number 3, we have a brand new tip for covering yourself while doing pyramid side jumps. As you guys know, when pyramiding yourself, you can either edit through the pyramid or jump to the side to take high ground. Doing side jumps on pyramids is an amazing way to retake the high ground, but it does leave you exposed to taking a shotgun shot. With this new tip, you can do the pyramid side jump all you want and guarantee covering yourself 100% of the time. A lot of people don't know this, but as soon as you place a pyramid, you can place a wall through it as well. This allows you to cover yourself from fire before you ever do the jump. Placing the wall before you jump gives instant cover and doesn't really have any counters. We learned this amazing tip from Ghost Snood and we highly recommend checking him out. Links to his socials will be in the description below. Coming in at number 2, we have a brand new building trick to get some easy trap kills. Whenever you're boxed up and someone is trying to replace your wall, you may get a small opening for an easy trap kill. Usually when someone can't replace your wall, they'll build a ramp and start going for your roof. As soon as they build their ramp, quickly edit out of your box and then pyramid them. This will allow you to box them in with spike traps for an easy kill. If the person trying to get into your box doesn't build a ramp, you can place your own ramp to bait them into placing theirs. This does require fast editing, but can result in super easy trap kills. We wanted to thank CypherPK for showing us this tip. Links to his socials will be in the description below. Finally, coming in at number one, we have a new way to counter someone ramping above you. As you guys know, when someone ramps over you, you can easily pyramid them to negate the high ground. Our first instinct after the pyramid is to turn around and start building out. This technique is completely fine, but it's actually really slow when retaking the high ground. When pyramiding someone who ramps directly over you, instead of turning around, jump to the side of the ramp and place a wall then a floor. Walls can easily attach to the side of ramps and this will allow you to build out or over them without losing any momentum. This technique is actually super easy to do with practice and can be an amazing tip in game. Anyway guys, it's gonna go ahead and wrap it up for this video. If you guys did enjoy the video, make sure you hit that thumbs up button down below. If you're brand new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell to never miss a Fortnite video or live stream. If you want to stay up to date with us, our Twitter, Discord, Instagram, and Twitch are in the description. And as always, thank you guys so, so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.